release of chapter 2 on Conan Exiles Age of Sorcery, girl hunting has come, how do we say, a little more obsolete. But nonetheless, it's still quite handy to have a named Taskmaster. As you can go to the Headhunter caravans, it does cost 50 ancient obelisks, and it is random RNG, so you may not get said fighting thrall or crafting thrall that you desire. So, you can come here to Mounds of the Dead, specifically to Ravage Burrows. Now you may run past these a million times, maybe even run into one or two of them. There's a few around and gone, why would I explore into those little death traps? If you haven't, they're definitely worthwhile. There's a couple of reasons to come in. Not only can you get, oh, let's make sure you have a truncheon on you. The name Taskmaster, like I said, there's also some of these guys that you can knock out. They're all right. I'm gonna kill them quickly. And then here's the guy we want. Whether my thrall's gonna behave or not, we'll see. Now you can either kill Gothrad for this thing, Thor Thorga's crest, but he's always here. So you can knock him out as well. He's a little bit tricksy to knock out, especially with a few of these guys around while he's aggroed over there. Sometimes I just knock all these guys out. It's a little easier, especially with my shitty stamina. Now, because he's a high level guy, using the dagger technique is not advisable particularly, but uh, we'll see what my thrall can do with his Seth's truncheon. There's a few boxes in here with some random loot. See if we can't leave them both outside, maybe. See, I'm um, doing a lot of damage to him, even with the uh, to attack. Not that great. So let's leave them both outside. I don't have a regular truncheon for myself. Hopefully my thrall will teleport eventually. Okay, we've all assembled outside. Now it's just basically a waiting game. If you happen to have a truncheon and not daggers, you can also help. Daggers are pretty good most of the time, except for occasionally with these like hardcore dudes. And Valencia and the Berserker are also not great to use the dagger technique with. I don't know what it is about them. They just take more damage than they do concussive damage. We'll be back in a moment when he's knocked out. While my thrall's working on him, I should say there are um, a couple of whites around here that you want to take out first, otherwise they'll get all up in your shit. Trying to knock him out is a bit inconvenient. Definitely want to try and drag him out here and bring a regular truncheon for yourself. Either have a um, teleport to your base located nearby where your wheel of pain is, or have a wheel of pain located. I am wearing armor that helps with my concussive damage because I don't have an authority build. An authority build is going to help immensely here as well. Now he's knocked out, you want to take him back to your wheel of pain and then he'll take some time to tame if you don't already have a named taskmaster or any other type of taskmaster I advise like maybe knocking out a two and then using that two to tame a three and then use that three to tame this guy and then keep them as just random spare ones if you're on a pvp server if you're on a solo server you, you might as well chuck them out really but essentially that's it and you can kill him like i said and get the crest and then go to the burrow next door and get this book from inside the box in the very center and then when we're a bit closer i'll show you the other burrow that you have to go in i think it's that one you kill a blue skeleton guy and then the one behind the obelisk there you go in there and you talk to a guy a little ghost dude and you can get the pride of a seer armor click there and i'm gonna add some meat you can collect mushrooms and if you've seen my recipe guide uh you'll know where to learn the cooked mushroom meal that uses puff mushrooms and amanita mushrooms put um, them in a wheel of pain and they are excellent food better than gruel in my opinion but for now i'm going to use steak do consider a like and a subscribe it means a lot and it helps me know that you find these videos handy and you'd like to see more of them and uh yeah that's about it and uh i hope you have an excellent day evening night or whatever it may be wherever you may be and until next time have a good one